Hi friends, this is Rahul. Welcome to our channel DIY Almost Everything. In our channel, we show you quick videos, informative videos which you can do at your home and enjoy. In last video, you saw that I did a camera activity for my borewell where the borewell was completely dried. And then I inquired about rebore which was costing very very high. So I decided to do a fresh bore because I really needed water. Uh, for my construction as well as for my day-to-day -day use for this I called a person who did a test to identify the bow point or the water source point and for this as a step one we did coconut test these guys come uh, with a coconut and they tell us where the water source is it is unbelievable technique uh, I call this person from my town itself uh, he seems to be a very very educated guy, very knowledgeable, very well to do uh, and uh, I tried to ask him that what is the trick and uh, he said it's all uh, something which comes within, something which is like an intuition. Uh, few people say it depends on the individual's hasta uh, resha uh, which is the lines on your hand, uh, you need to have jal resha. Uh, I tried doing it, I could not and let's see how we did it. Yeah, if you just notice the coconut uh, suddenly stands in a 90 degrees position as soon as it gets the water source and it is really unbelievable how they do it. So this is the point where there was water source and that's where the coconut was falling down. Wherever he is doing that mark with his leg, those are the points or the flow of water underground. Yeah, he, he went on the other side of my site and he started identifying the source. This helps him to identify the flow of water. So if you noticed uh, again the coconut went in 90 degrees standing position and this is the same line where he saw on the other side of the site. So first they check on the corners uh, of the site and then they actually check uh, in middle of the site so they it gives them a direction where the flow of water is. This was again the same line so if you uh, I noticed it has got plus, uh, plus uh, marking uh, one was from east to west and other is now north to south so he is able to identify the center point now so now he knows the source of
the construction is in a final stage so a lot of equipments are spread around but he was very nice supportive guy didn't complain about all the mess around So this is the exact point which he has identified and he has asked me to uh, bore here. Now in step 2 they use copper wires uh, to identify the source of water. Uh, they, what I read on Google this is not the only method used in India but even other countries use the same method of identifying uh, the water source or water flow uh, and this individual have two wires. Uh, which is L shaped wires little thick wire of copper uh, and this copper wire turns toward the direction of water sorry the video is not very clear because I didn't want it to disturb him while he was doing his study uh, but at, at some point of time in this video you will be able to see those uh, copper wires in his hand I hope you can see the wires now uh, it's a L shaped copper wire and it actually turns toward the direction of water As soon as we reach the recommendation point, uh, it actually crosses. Uh, see, that's how it crossed each other. exactly crossing each other at the point which he recommended us so he reconfirmed the same point now the third step was to identify the depth of the source so he not only recommended us the place but he also recommended what will be the level of water source so he used a spring with some metal kind of dome shaped small metal I don't know what metal it was uh, but after doing a spin over the area and then he used a spring as well basis both he confirmed to us that the first water source will be around 400 to 500 feet down and second water source will be around 700 to 800 feet down and the third will be around 1050 plus uh, he did said that you should be able to get a good source at 750 but in worst case scenario for 100% I will get at 1050 feet uh, I do plan to do boring pretty soon uh, and I will post that video as well to show whether it was success or not but uh, it was an amazing study and uh, it was really surprising how they do it uh, salute to these guys how they identify and help people he charged me only 1000 rupees for this activity that's it for today thank you for watching our video and uh, please subscribe to our channel please like and please share our videos thank you for watching and have a nice day ahead